It's me, your friendly neighborhood alien, stranded here on the third rock from your sun. And today, I'm going to play you some Dragon Age 2. But first, so today, I had to do grocery shopping and run some errands. And while at the big box store, picked up the um, uh, Coca-Cola Oreos and the Oreo Coke Zero. So I thought it might be kind of fun to try that on stream. So off to my side here, I've got two of the Coke or two of the um, Coke Oreos and a bottle of the you know Coke Zero Oreo, plus some regular Oreos and some regular Coke. And I'm gonna see how much of each other they taste like. So I'm gonna start by opening up some Coke, just regular Coca-Cola. There we go. Okay. That way I can get see what that tastes like. Now the Oreo. So we got the regular Oreo side. Um, we got a red Coca-Cola side. And inside's the cream filling. So I'm gonna try the cream filling. Definitely pop, popping candy in there. I grabbed two so I can have one like that and one regular. The red cookie, the Coca Cola cookie. I got the Coke in there. And that was the brown cookie. Some more regular Coke. And just one full Oreo. Well, wow. one full Coke Oreo. Okay, I'm definitely tasting coke in there. I'm de definitely tasting some coke. Okay. Mm. I'll put a palate cleanser. A little bit of palate cleanser. Okay. Reset my mouth. Now for the regular plain old Oreo cookie. Everybody knows and loves. Mm. Mm. I can see why Martins are so addicted to these. Do not, do not give Oreos to Martians, okay? They love them too much. They would kill for Oreos. They probably also kill for Hydrox, but I don't have any Hydrox in the other kit, so I can't really test with those. So 
Sorry, I want to be. Now the Oreo Coke Zero. It definitely doesn't smell quite like regular Coke. <laughs> Some my regular Coke. Okay. And back to the Coke Zero. It doesn't quite smell like regular Coca-Cola. Yeah, I can definitely taste some Oreo in there. I don't. I, I actually kind of like this uh, Oreo Coke Zero. It's kind of nice. It's not gonna replace uh, any cherry vanilla cola for me, but it, it's kind of nice. I, I kind of enjoy it. The cookies, me. I can take them or leave them. It, it, they, they don't matter to me. Or at least the, the, the Coke Oreos. I mean, they taste... Or the, yeah, the Coke Oreos. They taste fine. But I'm not the biggest fan of pop, popping candy, so... I think, I think I'm good without those. Okay. But but I definitely like this um, Oreo Coke Zero. I just wish it was like Oreo Coke. Not the Coke Zero part. Okay. Now time to hit the game. I want to turn on the turn this off. There we go. Now back to the game. And here's my here's Xavier Hawk. There's his butt. There's his face. He's in Hawk Manor. I thought I changed that. I thought I fixed that. I, th I knew I fixed it. I don't know why that. What, what happens? What happened there? But I know. I am positive. I fixed it. Sorry, I'm just gonna. There. That should be good enough. There, now you can see the game. Okay. There we go. So, what do we got in the journal? I'm gonna talk to Hubert about missing shipments, and then. We are going to do that one. Oh boy, already? Already? Uh. Honestly, they 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 are trying their hardest, aren't they? Yeah, definitely trying their hardest. Okay. Delete the message. And ban user. Okay. There we go. In case real chatters come in. I definitely do not want those ones. Good boy. Chomp mints. 
Yes, you do, Sandal. I hope he's in the next game. I miss him. I do. I miss him. I, I miss him a lot. Okay, we're going to go do Hubert. So, I'm going to take you. Uh, definitely, I, I might want a healer. I don't take Fenris. This does not involve the city guard, so. And then I'll make sure everything's done before the, we finish the act. But we're not going to finish the act tonight. I know that much. Hello. That dwarf was getting really friendly with me. I can't imagine what Hawk sees in you. It is done. Leave it be. Well, good. I always knew he had some sense. Do not make light of this. Leaving was the hardest thing I've ever done. You know, you, you keep like that. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna bring Meryl back. I'm gonna do this with Meryl. Oh yeah, and um, for my for my just fun play, I want to do the cat. I'll do normal, but for, for stream, I just want to do casual. Okay. Honestly, good point. The impeccable bulf. Here you go, Mr. Impeccable. This fell into my hands. Recognize it. Well, isn't that a sight for sunblind eyes? Thank you more than kindly. Yes, you have your pants back. I want to see if Worthy has anything to say. Heard your jaunt into the deep roads went rather well. Good for you. No. You got my letter. Yes, I did. You've been gone a while. I thought you had things under control. I told you I would handle this, and I did. Now, after a year of raids on our shipments, I finally caught one of the culprits. Oh, that's good. One of our miners, Sabine, has been leaking information. Do you know him? He claims to be from your hometown in Ferelden. Well, Lothar, he was a pretty big village. I would like you to get this festering saw to divulge who is behind the thefts. When you are ready, I will bring Sabine to you. So, he's from Lothar? Who is this man? I would not expect you to recall every piss pot from your past. That's the problem with being a big fish in a small pond. I could never tell the little fish apart. Well... He brags to his fellows that he grew up with you in Luthering. Yeah, well, let's go do this. Bring Sabine back to my place. Excellent idea. I will get him now. Why do I have to torture a man for information? That's a, that doesn't sound fun. Here is the dung pile I caught leaking next week's shipment schedule. He won't tell me who he's working with. Who else has been screwing me over? Tell me, you ratting mongrel! Uh, dude, please. He can't talk with a mouthful of broken teeth. Please, Miss Sir, help me. I knew you since you was young and lothering. I knew your mum's family and your pop. Mike, you got him rest. Pathetic. <laughs> I leave this bastard in your capable hands. Get me when he's ready to talk. Thank you, Miss Yeah, I'm not going to be violent. Slothering folks should stick together. So, what made you betray your employer? AKA me. Before the blight, my family had a good life in Lothering. Clean home, fertile lands, friends. And cook while we lived in a hovel. People spit on us, and some days we went hungry. 
Look, I understand it. I know it was hard to leave Lothering. Talk to me so we can put all this behind us. As soon as I tell Hubert what he wants to know, he'll kill me or throw me in prison. My life's not worth much but my family. I only wanted to give my wife and son a better life. Dude. He's talking to somebody else from Lothering and he's made it pretty good right now, so... I'll deal with you, Bear. Just give us something to go on. Oh, thank you, Monsieur. I'll talk. Hawk, this is Lily of the Coterie. Given the importance of stopping the cargo robberies, I have enlisted a consultant. Consultant? Sure. Whatever helps you sleep at night. Well, Doug, are you ready to bark now? I really want to kick him in the head. There's an ambush. Plan tonight at Dietrich Crossing. Tonight? That leaves you barely enough time to intercept them. You had best leave immediately. We'll protect your precious shipment. But make sure you have the Coterie's payment. Want me to deal with this runt? Free of charge. I'll drop him in a ditch on our way out. Yes, take him. With my blessing. I assume my partner will not object. No. Sabine's been a helpful chap. Plus, he says our villains threatened to kill his wife and son. They even killed his dog. To prove a point, his dog, you bear. You know how important they are to Ferelden's. Huh. There's a thousand such sub stories in Lowtown. This does not make it right what he did, but it takes the sting off. After all I've done for these poor refugees. Yeah, uh huh. All you've done? Sabine Wait. is grateful for all your generosity, and his heart grieves that he must leave. Now. Oh. Thank you, Miss Hayes. I know I don't deserve it, but thank you. So We're wasting time. Some but if you find Norfolk mm. corpses at the ambush, it won't be my fault. Somebody posted in the Dragon Age subreddit. We're too late for your boys, but we'll make the rotters pay. About um what what they definitely won't do in a playthrough of the Dragon Age game. You know, a choice that they will, you know, never take. And one of my choices is, I'm sparing that guy's life. I'm always going to do that because... It's a refugee that... Mm, I can't play an evil hawk, that's the problem. I even tried playing an, a, a, a jerk inquisitor once and I could not. Okay. Been a while since I played just normal rogue. Not doing that. That was almost too easy. Wait, I recognize that lout. Who is he? He's in the coterie. One of that damned fool Brecker's men. 
Okay, so... Brecker? Tell me about this man. He operates out of the south side. Always had more balls than sense. I don't need to know what's between his pants. Brecker must be involved. So your organization is behind this? We got explicit orders not to. Hubert's been good on his payments. If Brecker ordered this, the rest of his life will be very short and painful. Well, then I guess we gotta meet this man. Let's pay Brecker a social call. We've got a lot to talk about. I've got to be sure first. I know who to lean on to get answers. Find me in the Undercity. Okay. Now, let me loot. You know, I think I've been to this place before. No, I will never get tired of the joke. Okay. I'm going to let her lean on. I'm going to go find um, that herbalist task i got to find. The Harlot's Blush. Okay. I seem to recall you saying something a while ago. Shut up. I can control it. Wasn't that what you said? So help me. You know, you two should just kiss and get it over with. Actually, please don't. I don't want to be in a polyamorous relationship with Anders. I don't mind polyamorous relationships, but I do I do mind them with Anders. I mean polyamorous in video games. I don't think I could do that in real life. Too much of a coward. I know I've been up here, but I wanna hit the wounded coast for the harlot's blush. I found my way down. There we go.
Uh, I hate pissing off people that are like way across the map, basically. I'm not the outdoors type. The sooner we're back in the city, the happier I'll be. <clears throat> there are many lords and ladies in Valrio. I mean this literally. Once the system of noble titles in Orle was labyrinthine. There were barons and barons and baronets and sir barons and horde barons and other barons and other things, each with their own origins and own nuances of comparison. The Orlesian aristocr aristocracy Aristocracy. My brain did not want to pronounce that right. Aristocracy is ancient and given to competition. All the nobility play the grand game as it is known, whether they wish to or not. It is a game of reputation and patronage, where moves are made with rumor and scandal is the chief weapon. No gentle game, this. More blood has been drawn as a result of the grand game than any war the Orlesians have ever fought. Of this, I am assured by almost every gentleman here. As far as titles went, everything changed with the coming of Emperor Dracon, who established the Orlesian Empire as it exists now, and who created the Chantry. There is no more venerated figure in Orle, in Valerio. The statue of Dracon stands as tall as the statue of Andraste. Dracon determined that the grand game was tearing Orle apart, so he abolished all titles besides his own and Lord and Lady. I am told with some twittering amusement that his action did not end the grand game as Draken intended. Now lords and ladies collected unofficial titles rather than official ones, such as the exalted patron of Tassus Clay or uncle to the champion of Trems. It is a headache to remember such titles, and one wins to think of the poor doorman at balls who must rattle them off as each guest enters the room. Oh yeah, that, that that's 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 yeah, that's gonna be difficult. The aristocratic, aristocracy, aristocrat, aristocracy. I have problems with that word. Aristocracy is different from Ferelden in other ways as well. The Orlesian's right to rule stems directly from the Maker. There exists neither the concept of rule by merit nor the slightest notion of rebellion. If one is not noble, one aspires to be, or at least aspires to be in the good graces of a noble, and is ever watching for a way to enter the patronage of those better placed in the grand game. And then there are the masks, and the cosmetics. I have not seen so much paint since the kennels at High Ever, but that is another story. From Beyond the Frostbacks by Ban Teoric of West Hill, 920, The Lagon. So what do you got? got anything cool? Eh. Eh. Eh, nothing really I want. There we go. There's the Heartless Blush. I was gonna get up there eventually. I'm off the map. Oh, you're giving your Talb your your Cerebist, uh superior light gauntlets. Uh, definitely our Talbashoth. I think there's one more thing I have to do here. I'll come back here one more time with Aveline. Uh, offered and lost. The Grand Railroad, Herbalist Tasks. So let's do the Herbalist Tasks and then see what else I have to do over here. Then I gotta get to the Undercity. I don't want to get to the Undercity. So you found your brother. 
I did. Wasn't expecting that. I assume there was a time when you and he were friends. With Bartrand? No. Just brothers. Occasionally he wasn't insufferable. And yet you remained at his side. Too bad he didn't do the same. Oh, Lane, how's he gone? They got Grace and the others. Brought them back here. Sorry. I'm sure that decision won't come back and bite me in the butt. Brilliant. I'm amazed that you found everything. My craft can begin anew. Your reward, my young friend. See if there's anything I want. Eh. Nothing that I really want. Okay, I'm not nothing we'll worry about. My best friend just failed with heroin. They killed him on the spot. Yeah, they they kinda do that. Because he's technically an abomination at that point. Technically. At least I don't have to go to the bone pit. I don't want to go to the bone pit. Nobody needs to go to the bone pit. Oh, cheer up, Larby. You're making me cry just looking at you. Don't. You made a mistake. It happens. I almost killed a girl. You've killed 254 by my last count. Plus about 500 men, a few dozen giant spiders, and at least two demons. It's not the same. Why? Because this one you feel bad about? Maybe that's the problem. I'm going this way just in case. Okay, I, can't, I I got whatever was down there. Okay, I'm gonna save. Oh shit. Well, I'm looting your body at least. Let them get away. You coterie, one of Lily's friends. Lily was one of ours. She was working for you, and now she's dead. You get one chance. Did you kill her? Lily didn't die by my hand. Someone else did this. Explain yourself. Present minor misunderstandings aside, I believe our purposes are the same. One of the scum that attacked my caravans worked for someone in the coterie named Brecker. Lily said she'd look into it. I think Brecker had her killed. Brecker, hmm. If you're lying, I'll find you. Men, we have to get to the bottom of this. Now. Also gonna end as many things peacefully. That's, that's kind of how I tend to play. If I can do peaceful, I will. Turn up your purses, Kurtwall. The leases of Javaris Tintop are up for grab. You know, you should be at least doing that in Low Town. You're not going to get much of an audience, uh, in the Undercity 80, because I'm sure that stuff's expensive. In Low Town, people might actually have some money. I don't think the Dark Town people really have much money. Okay.
Okay, I guess everybody's okay. I really didn't have to do anything. I like that. Come on, boy, we got this. I don't have a numerical keyboard plugged in right now, do I? No, I do not. Too late. That's why I do casual. Okay, got plenty of uh, level ups now. Okay. Okay, I'm going to plug in a numerical keypad right now, I think. For one very important reason. Okay, can I get over here? Can I get over here? Okay, plug this in. Nope, other way. Can't really see what I'm doing. My hands in the way. Okay. Turn on my keypad. Okay. We're going to walk. Nope. You must be Brecker. And you're that lice covered refugee. Hey. That's not a nice thing to say about my dog. You'd better leave the bone pit shipments alone. Understand? You're making demands of me. Yes. You own half a stake in a mine and you think you're somebody, huh? Some Ferelden's don't have the courtesy of knowing when to bloody die. Okay. Plenty of windows for people to jump out of. 
Now, you you think, you, you know, what might be good security for Kirkwall is shutters. I have to think it's traps. Hey, Brecker. Yes, venture forth. Oh, wait. In my pocket. Yeah, I, I need this. Ugh. Sorry. Yeah, it was a coterie. They did it. I found the thieves responsible for the cargo theft. I put them out of business. Excellent. With that resolved, the mine's profits will soar. Mm -hmm. For now, partner, please be sure to visit our workers occasionally. You have a knack for keeping them happy. Yeah, because I'm a good boss. That's why you... Okay. Okay, <sighs> mother, but I've got to look after my needs first. Okay. I'm gonna take fair take Fenris let Fenris and Anders go. Well, well yeah, I'm gonna let no. We'll see what we need to do. But I will definitely be taking Aveline with me. I'll take Aveline and Meryl with me this time. We're out to Wounded Coast and then we'll do... Uh, the stuff that I don't want to do because it leads to other stuff that I really don't want to do. Get rid of Anders for now. Okay, I'm gonna go do something. Something on the wounded coast I think I need to do. But I'm not sure. Okay, puppies are asleep. Sunshine, Daisy, Ravaney. What am I? Beg your pardon? You don't call anyone by name except for me. Where's my nickname? That's not true. There's Hawk and Bianca. Hawk is a family name, and Bianca is a crossbow. Don't change the subject. Haven't thought of a good one yet. What do you think of Red? Too common. Well, when you think of one, let me know. Muscles. Um. Um. Brick wall. I mean, she's tough as one. I think there was something down here, but I'm not positive. So I'm going down here. I haven't been down here yet. 
I don't remember. See, I saw something. Didn't she just say keep your buddy heads down? What's up? Lieutenant Harley? Aveline? Thank the Maker. I take it you know each other. Harley is one of the Guard, recently promoted. This disaster was my first routine assignment. So? I happen to be in the area. Seeing the sights, killing bandits, the usual. Not the best time for jest. Always is. We're up against Evett's marauders. You're certain about that? Del Orden's up there. And Victor Longdeath's handiwork you've already seen. We tried two sorties up the path, but it's trapped to oblivion. Now I'd be thankful just to get out of here alive. No fair, God Dog! You brought friends! Shut your mouth! <laughs> okay, so. Fail Orden, Victor Longdeath, what are you talking about? They have been robbing and raping the Maker knows how long. Did a broad daylight assault on the keep to rescue one of their number two years back. Fell Orden, a blood mage, is here. Victor Longdeath, Sophie. Maker, you certainly drew a fine first detail. Okay, so. Isn't it suicide to stay pinned down here? We're pinned down right now, but so are they. If we run, Everett's Marauders escape again. So we've been waiting for reinforcements. Victor's arrows and Auden's fireballs taking their toll. But we can still take them down. Okay, then. The longer we wait, the more of us they'll kill. Let's attack now. I'm with you, but my men may be too rattled to join us. Then stay here and um, keep cover and cover us. It's too dangerous for you and your men. Stay put. I'll take care of it. Look out for traps. Be careful. Everett's mortars are deadly. Sorry, Eveline, but I'm protecting your men. Okay. There we go. Okay, where is... No, I should have my dog out here too. Watch 
your step. I disable that trap. All set. There's a massive bounty offered on the Marauders. Help us to kill them, and you'll be rich. The longer we wait, the more. I'm with you, but my men may be. Get as many of them as. Men! I mean, you went. Look out for traps. Be careful. Everett's marauders are deadly. Everett's marauders are dead. What are you talking about? Wow. This was a dog fight. A true dog fight. We fought dogs. And the dogs didn't win, surprisingly. And you know, if they were up against my puppy, they, they, they would totally lose. He's 22 pounds of pure tongue and slobber. He would lick him to death. Hi. Hello. I guess I didn't want to join in the fight. I knew there was some that there that, that. I like the looks of this. All set. We doing okay, guys? Hmm. Yeah, there's something I want to do out here. Okay. I think down here I want to grab. Okay. Oh, then back in Kirkwall. Ah, mm. last ah, stretch. Had to stretch. <sighs> that seems weird. That seems very weird. Well, I'm going to look this up. Let's see if that's a bug in there. Okay.
Um, I don't. Okay, so there's definitely a bug in there somewhere. Okay, well, let's, let's, I'm gonna go back there. I'm gonna go talk to the lieutenant one more time. It's not marking it as no, well, it's still marking it there. So I wanna try talking one more time. Then we'll head out. There's a massive bounty offered on the Marauders. Help us to kill them, and you'll be rich. The longer we wait, the more of us they'll kill. Let's attack now. I'm with you, but my men may be too rattled to join us. Get as many of them as you can, and let's go. Men! We're taking the battle to them. Look out for traps. Be careful. Everts Mordors are deadly. Okay. So, yeah, I definitely did that. Well, maybe I can come back with Isabella. Okay. I'm going to grab Fenris. And I'm the rogue, so I'm going to leave... I'm going to leave Varric at home, I think. I think this is going to be a quest where I'm going to leave Varric at home. Because when dealing with Canary, I, I kind of want to have Fenris with me to be on the safe side. I don't want to have Fenris with me. So, Merrily, you're going to be my ranged. Good day. Seneschal? You have information about the missing Canari. I am to help you, yes. Viscount Dumas would appreciate discretion. In oh, this yes, total discretion for us. I would prefer that you were not involved at all. But that is neither here nor there. So... I'm having a hard time picturing the abduction of a Kunari entourage. Unfortunately, they were not at their best. Their swords were tied into their sheaths. As oh, I peace knots. It seemed a respectful compromise. Even I know you cannot separate a Kunari from his weapon. It sounds like you don't want them found. I must think of what is best for the Viscount's office. Bringing attention to such an incident benefits no one. You would do nothing. The Kunari are neutral hostiles at best. There is no relationship to salvage by overextending ourselves on their behalf. Mm. The Arishok is growing violent. He might want an excuse to end this peace. I suspect that if the Arishok wanted to take over, he simply would. For all we fear that heretical Kuhn of his, its demands have done more to keep him in check than any of our efforts. Besides, would Kunari stoop to trickery? There is no precedent, but there is unfortunate evidence of influence on our side. Has anyone reported this to the Kunari? Maker, no. I'd be signing the messenger's death warrant. 
He'll find out soon enough, of course. And when he does, the Viscount is rightly concerned that the illusion of peace will dissolve. So what do we know? I'm sure you have suspicions about what happened. My concerns are well founded. This could not have escaped the notice of the city guard. Unless they were involved. Have any failed to report? Several. You should start with one of them. Although where you find a swordsman so eager to sell his honor and duty, I'm sure I don't know. The hanged man. Hangman. Got to be. Hanged man. Right. Then you know what to look for. I can't imagine this has occurred without notice. There is always a weak link. Please keep this quiet. The Viscount is under enough scrutiny as it is. Okay, let's do level ups here first. Okay. I'm going to get my constitution up a little bit, so I'm going to get my cunning right there where it is now. I've got one ability point to spend. Let's move these two over this way. Anything that's sustained, I want to move over there. I'm going to put this over in seven. I'm going to move, the, move, move crypto over there. Whoops. Okay, time to go to the hanged man. At least Aveline did not take that as like a personal attack. Interesting happening around town. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I'll have to come back here at night. Yeah, I'm going to go visit Uncle Gamlin. Let's go visit Uncle Gamlin. Now we come back here at night. Yeah, Uncle Gamlin hasn't seen us for a while. Consider my offer for you to train the guard into winter fighting techniques. I've heard nothing. My abilities were inflicted, not taught. I will not pass that on. Some good should come of them. No. <sighs> Broody elf. At least we left him in low town. We'd have no money if we didn't. You were more 
naive than I thought. What have I done to you now? To me? Nothing. Not yet. To yourself? You can't even begin to imagine the number of mages that have walked down the path you're now on. My clan didn't believe in me. If you don't believe in me either, I won't mind. See, I understand that blood magic is not a good thing to do. We're in Meryl's house. Sup, twins. I forgot I gotta do that at night. Hang out Meryl's place. Play cards. Meryl just lost. A lot. Again. Expensive tastes for this place. That's right, pal. Tonight I'm paid and blessed. And all I had to do was turn my head. To all my friends. Hey, step back. I know important people. We're going to show this city what to do with heathen oxmen. Guard captain, would you like to have a word with your man? Guard captain? Who? What? <gasps> Who? Who what? I don't... Who bought you? Who bought the honor of a proud guard of Kirkwall and made him a drunken Mabari bitch? I, I don't... I don't know. He is not happy. I swear. He had the seal of the Grand Cleric and everything. It's true. The penalty for abandoning your post is ten days on the wall. I expect you to report in the morning. Uh-huh. Hmm. Yeah. There's your answer. A Templar. With the Grand Cleric seal, no less. Well done. This is why you bring Aveline. I hope you don't mind I ruin your dinner date. Poor guy. Whoops. And I know said the next time we came here, she would teach me to do something called body shots. Aveline. Don't teach the blood maids about body body shots. Hanging out with Varric all night. I lost at cards. Again. So you're taking the captain of the guard to accuse the Grand Cleric of funding zealots? Yes. Don't forget the kidnapped Konari. That too. Some days, Hawk. Now we know who it is. The Grand Cleric, please. Tell her... Tell her three Kunari leave an estate and let her finish. Sarah Hawk. Sister Patrice. Mother Patrice. Time has changed us both. Yes. Grand made you an even more <coughs> an to just anyone. What do you want? Oh. Funny how you and issues with the Kunari seem to go together. And you always assume their side. I was naive when last we met. I did not want you dead, but I felt a death was necessary. That may be too fine a point for you to understand. But you must admit, you came out the better for it. Uh -huh. I know you, and I know someone is abusing the Grand Cleric's seal. Who are you to question who serves her grace? 
I am sorry, but I see no reason to let you pass. How about the fact that her authority was used to abduct Kunari? A pause that says you knew. But does her grace? The Grand Cleric trusts her stewards to enact the wishes of the Maker. It sounds like you've been bad. This will shock her grace, no doubt. Stubborn. All right, Sarah Hawk. If you won't abandon this, let me offer you something. The Templar you seek is a radical who has grown unreliable. Confronting him may do us all a favor. And his relation to you is? He is my former bodyguard, Ser Von El. Assume what you wish, but I offer him to you as reconciliation. Meet me at this location. I invite you, Sarah Hawk. Come see the unrest these Kunari have inspired. You know, Meryl. I say I'm skeptical. It's her game for the moment. I'll take Sebastian with me. And I am going to make mention of this to the revered mother. If I can. Your grandparents would be so proud of you. When I was a girl, the Amels were one of our most yeah, uh -huh. prominent families. I'm glad to have one of their line in the estate again. Oh, thank you. How can I help you? Um... Did you know someone used the authority of your name to instigate a crime against the Kunari? The path to righteousness is never as straight and narrow as we wish. Uh huh. I truly hoped this would not go so far. You should investigate but this. Do not trouble yourself. I will step in when it's time. I'll take the blessing. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's a bad friendship. I just, I don't want to be mean to her, but she is useless. didn't free me I see you've been thinking about what I said I freed myself if the maker did anything he watched why should I thank him for that is it so hard to believe the maker cares for you maybe he gave you the chance to escape or she it doesn't feel like the maker cares for me or anyone we all make our own choices to do good as well as evil that is our doing, not the Maker's. Perhaps. It's been a long time since I gave it any thought. It's not too late to start. These doors must be very expensive. It could have been used to help a lot of refugees in Lowtown. I'm just saying. Oh, it is. My computer is really hot. I'm watching the ACN in here. It's getting warm in here, and I really need to cool my computer down. My keyboard's hot. So, sorry about the noise. I got the window, like, right here. I'm right in the corner near the window. But my keys are warm, so... Need to cool things off a bit. Easy place to get cornered. Patrice is here somewhere. Ugh. This is why I want the city guard involved. Yeah, I think I've been here before. Like 
any beast, remove the fangs and it is lost. They are weak before the faithful of the Maker. The only certainty in their precious cune is death before the righteous. He doesn't look too happy. Savonel. Oh, I don't like her. Take a knee, faithful. The Chantry blesses us. You claim a blessing when you have used the authority of the Grand Clerics? So that you probably them. slipped him. You have brought wrath down upon you. You remember Sarah Hawk? The Kunari have friends, Templar. How will you answer their allegations? <sighs> no offense, but I respect the Kunari. You want a fight? Face someone whose weapons are not bound. Righteous, destroy them. I'll still get her someday. Sorry, I just want to get this pose reference here. Just want to get a pose reference. Okay, that should be enough for pose reference. Sorry, but I'm wanting to get that. as a pose reference for a bit now. Thank you, Fenris. to bring this mess to the Viscount's attention. But I didn't get a loot anybody. Madness. Madness. That's a word for it. Chantry involvement. Even if they are fringe elements. Oh, it could not be worse. Her Grace had no knowledge of this affair. I trust she will deal with it swiftly. You killed them. All of them. I have claimed. Father serving the Grand Cleric allowed this to happen. Are you quite sure? She held a blade with them, told them to fight you. 
Oh, yes. No, I cannot say that. Well, of course not. Blasted mother. You have no idea the storm these allegations would cause. It would destroy what support I do have. Well, at she'll probably hide This it. may have scared her off. She claimed this was not her intention. Well, that is something. I will make my inquiries. Gently. And you should be careful in your associations. For now, we have other problems. We have the delegate, but... I can't return the bodies to the Canari in this state. Sarah Hawk. You know the Adishok. What should I do? Hiding this would only make it worse. It would, wouldn't it? I'm losing my sense of how to balance this nightmare. That's what happens when the Chantry's involved. I appreciate your help in this matter. As bad as this is, it could have been much worse without you. Kirkwall owes you. I owe you. Yes, you do. Okay. Oh, good. I can do loot bodies. Especially this one. No, I think I've been here before today. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't want to do this one. I do not want to do this one. I do not. I do not want to do this one. Look what I found. Your reason for living. You brought it home. I am right stunned, actually. Safe or stupid? This is probably going to be something very stupid. This I'll do alone. Delegate was taken from the Viscount's doorstep, and he still claims control of this city. I thought it impossible, but I respect him even less. How do you explain the condition of their bodies? A fanatic used them to incite others of his kind. I accept that. Well, that was easy. I have seen every vice and weakness of your kind, and how few of you take responsibility. Your Viscount remains a fool, but you are not. Panahedan, Hawk. I will keep one good thought about your kind. Okay, he took that better than I thought. I, I thought I should let him know. Thank you, sir. Like I said, I have respect for the Canari. I don't agree with the Canari. But I have respect for the canary. Okay. Time to go home.
Not looking forward to this one. Not looking forward to this one at all. Enchantment! No, Leandra. Leandra. Shouting won't make him understand you better, you know. There you are. Where's your mother? Is she feeling all right? I'm sure she's all right. Why are you so upset? Your mother didn't show up for our weekly visit. Is she ill? She is here, isn't she? No, Gamlin. We haven't seen her all day. Where could she be? With her suitor, perhaps? Suitor? Leandra never mentioned a suitor. Well, those lilies arrived for her this morning. Uh... White lilies? I know something about that. Don't just leave me waiting. What is it? There's a killer in Kirkwall who sends his victims white lilies before he takes them. He's murdered several women. Ah, uh, I should not have said that. I know someone who might be able to help. Gascard Dupuis. No, you're wrong. Leandra is fine. Well, I'll talk to Aveline and we'll see if we can do something about this. Aveline will get the city guard to keep an eye out. Don't worry, Uncle. Oh, all right. That girl will know what to do. Maybe... Maybe Leandra took another path to my house. I could have just missed her. I'm going back to Lowtown. You should help Gamlin look for your mother. You might be able to track her more easily once night falls and the streets empty out. All right. The boy and I will stay here in case she returns. Good to see you again, Sarah. Everything's quiet here in the mansion. Yeah. Very quiet. Very quiet. Nothing at all going on. Nothing at all. I hate this quest. I really hate this quest. I really, I really hate this quest. I hate this quest so much. Going to Dark Town, see if I can find him. He said he'd be in the city, right? See if he knows anything. There he is. Gascard. Hawk, what are you doing here? Do you have something? I want this killer, and you're going to help me find him. Why? Not your business. Yeah, I'm not happy right now. Remember Alessa, the woman you rescued? Just as I predicted, he took her Wrong not one. long after you found us. I have enough of her blood for one ritual. I can use it to track them. It will lead us straight to the killer. Do you think we'll find my mother in time? You can pray for it. You could have tracked the killer this whole time. Why haven't you done it? I lost the power to confront him when you destroyed my shades. But with your help, we could go now. He'll be no match for us. Use the blood. I need to find my mother. Stand back. If there is anything left of Alessa in this world, this ritual will find it. Sorry, Fenris. 
but I, I, I don't like this quest. Take his disapproval right now. This place feels strange. Wrong. Don't you remember? You found Nanette's hand here. Mother must be here somewhere. We need to look around. Sorry, I'm, I'm still a game player. like someone forgot to conceal the door to his hideout. This wasn't here before. Mother must be down there. With him. Okay. Hi, Hershey. Thanks for the lurk. I do not like this quest at all. I do not like this quest at all. Mother! Alessa! She used quick climb to preserve her feet. Not sure whether the texture of the skin is to my liking. We'll try other methods. Oh boy. Breath. 
Marin. That's a pretty name. I saw her hands. Long, slender fingers. Fair skins. The life's of, light hands of a lifelong scholar. Oh, to lock my own clumsy fingers in her, hers again. Mm. Mother's locket. This isn't a good sign. Does he live here? Hey, Gas Gaspard, do something. Do something. Is this? Oh, that's a pretty little shrine. The woman in the painting. She almost looks like mother. This man is either very devoted or very insane. I need to find her. Now. That should do it. I do not like this quest at all. I do not like this quest at all. My dear friend, I have obtained the books you requested. I'll leave them at our usual hiding spot. Please collect them as soon as possible. I would hate to see them in the wrong hands. Your last letter was fascinating. You have proven me wrong once again by doing the impossible. I shouldn't have doubted your resolve, and I hope you will keep me apprised of further progress. Your friend and colleague, O. <sighs> yeah, no. Necromantic rituals? What terrible things are going on down here? Why would he have these? What's he planning? Today is our anniversary. I had hoped to complete my work before now, but one piece is missing. I'm so sorry, love. Please wait a little longer. I haven't forgotten my promise. When I see it, I'll know. I would know that face anywhere. Um, I think you can guess what's going to happen next. <laughs> oh.
I was wondering when you'd show up. Leandra was so sure you'd come for her. Mother always knew me best. Yes. And she spoke so fondly of you. What a lovely, gentle woman. Quentin! Gascard! So, you've reached me after all these years. I figured you gave up. Why? Are you afraid? Hoping Gascard would have forgotten what you did? Afraid? Of Gascard? <laughs> no. Gascard respects me too much to kill me. Shut up. I am going to learn your secrets, old man. Everything you kept from me. Sorry to interrupt this lovely student-teacher reunion, but where is my mother? Listen to me. Together we can defeat Quentin. Once he's dead, you'll have your mother back. And his research and writings will be mine. I'm sorry, Gascard. When my wife died, I lost all hope. I wasn't able to be the mentor you deserve. But now, my work is finished. And I can teach you as I always meant to. Come back to me, Gascard. You'll let me be part of this. You'll teach me the secrets of necromancy. I... Good. Thank you, Varric. Makes me feel a little bit what? better. You were going to do that, right? Oh yes. You will never understand my purpose. Your mother was chosen because she was special. And now she is part of something greater. Spare me the demented rambling. Where is she? She is here. She is waiting for you. I don't like this. 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 I do not 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 like this. I do not. I do not. I do not. I do not. No, 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 no. I hate this quest. 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 I found her eyes. A skin. Her delicate fingers. I hate this. I, at last. Her face. Oh, this beautiful face. I've searched far and wide to find you again, beloved. And no I don't force like this. of this I don't earth like will this. part us. I don't like this. You're dead. Oh, you're so dead. You're dead. You're dead. Can't keep that shield up forever, asshole. Come on. Come on! One more is vanquished. Oh, I got one. You brought this on yourself, you know. So, we won. I'm going after the big one. You can have the rest. Come on. Drop that shield.
mother. His magic was the only thing keeping her alive. I'm so sorry. I knew you would come. You know me. I always save the day. Shh. Don't fret, darling. That man would have kept me trapped in here. Now, I'm free. I get to see Carver again. And your father. But you'll be here alone. I'll be fine, Mother. My little boy has become so strong. I love you. You've always made me so proud. I hate this part. I really hate this part. Did you find her? I'm sorry, Uncle. She's gone. You were right about the flowers and everything. I... I can't believe she's gone. I was too late. So you're to blame. If you'd been quicker or stronger, you could have... She could be... <laughs> Why her? Why Leandra? The killer used Mother to magically reconstruct his dead wife. They had the same... face. What sort of nightmarish magic is that? Oh, Maker! Maybe the Templars are right. Lock the mages up. Throw away the key. You're happy they took Bethany away? No, I didn't mean it like that. I wish magic hadn't touched her. She would have been better off. Magic's always run in this family. It's a curse. Now even your mother's fallen victim to it. I wish you'd never told me what that twisted son of a bitch did to her. I wish I hadn't asked. I hope you killed him. Oh, I did. Good. I hope it hurt. So do I. I will deal with breaking the news to Bethany. You've enough on your mind. Take care, my boy. I don't know what to say, but I am here. Am I to blame for not saving her? I could say no, but would that help? You were looking for forgiveness, but I'm not the one who can give it to you. that quest that's a hard quest that I did not want to do it always just kicks me right in the head mm. I do not want to end the stream on that
Okay. I'm sorry about your mama. I will miss her. My lord, I'm so sorry. Mistress Hamel was a fine woman. Reminded me of my own mother. If there's anything I can do. That big tower in the lake is scary. He means he goes. Okay, I'm gonna just make sure I killed everybody at night. And then I guess the final few things that need to get done will get done. I don't think I'd be changing the act tonight, but I might end the act tonight. I'm going to try to finish up everything else, I think. I hate that quest so much. The thing is, there's no other quest like it in any of the other games that really... Well, Tamlin's showing back up when I do the Daylight Origin. Nothing in Inquisition that hits that hard. Evening, Captain. Evening, Captain. Right now, I just want to kill something. I don't think there's anything left in Hightown for me to kill. I really hate that quest.
Every piece of equipment in the free marches begins here. Good for them. As you can see, I'm not enthused about that. I'll try to muster up more excitement about factoids, about Clark Wall right now. still talk to Aveline or Isabella. Look, I don't care about changing you, man. get richer. We sit and rot. Oh, okay. I think I'm feeling a little better now. Still haven't killed anybody yet, though.
Okay. The Dread Wolf! Why is my house always such a mess when people are here? It's clean sometimes, I swear. So he comes down wearing nothing but his boots. We have a few drinks and everyone's laughing. But he doesn't care. He was naked. Just airing things out, he said. Ah! I think I need a bath. Do you think I need a bath? Seeing if anybody has anything to say. its hinges, walked into the room, and <clears throat> I guess we'll finish this later. Have you got a minute, Varric? Of course, Hawk. Actually, I've been meaning to talk to you. People say you and that uh, elf, you know, the angsty Tevinter one, are becoming quite the item. So, what's going on, Hawk? Well, 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 I never thought you were the type, Varric. I'm flattered. Hawk. I know I'm damn near irresistible, but you're just too high maintenance for me. Sorry. Listen, as your friend, I feel like I'd be doing you a disservice if I didn't say something. You do know the elf is covered in spikes, like an angsty porcupine. He might have some issues. Hmm. In all the time you've known me, have I ever given you the impression that I was turned off by crazy? <laughs> okay, point taken. This is the best tap. Maybe he likes you. He knows. He knows that I know. But what he doesn't know is that I know that he knows that I know. How do you know that he doesn't know that you know that he knows that you know you know? This is the best tavern in Kirkwall. It could use some cute dwarven serving girls, but otherwise, it's perfect. Oh, look, I don't want to end the, the uh, act right now. I do not want to end the act. But I think I need to just to clear my head. Might take a break though to put up, make sure I got a mod in there. I can't go on like this. Okay, we'll take your head. I am not in a good mood right now. Even worse when it's him. When Gascard Dupuis is there too. 
Never done that that way. Orc. I don't care what else is going on. We haven't spoken about Leandra. How are you? My mother is dead. My heart's broken. I suppose I could say, at least you knew yours. But that seems more about me than you. I just have flashes of possibly long hair. But my father... Would you like to hear one thing? You've never talked about him. My father trained me in all the skills he had been forced to give up. He spent everything to get me into Kalen's service. Do you know what I remember? When he read to me, stupid things, dragons and heroes. He wouldn't turn a page until I reached over and took his hand. That big man made every step of the story my choice. I loved that. He died of the wasting in a Denerim ward. Those last weeks, I read to him. I had to take his hand to turn the pages, and I couldn't tell if he was too weak, or if it was the old game. He smiled at that, at his big girl. <sighs> I don't know why I'm telling you this. Drink? A glass for those we've lost. <sighs> All right, then. Benoit Dulac and Leandra Hawke. Don't let anyone tell you when to move on. Take their hand and say, my choice. That's all I have. I'll miss her too. Good day to you, Sir Arthur. Good day, Sir Arthur. I'll make sure all the quests are done before I go back home, I guess. Miss me? Sarah Hawk, it is good to see you. The shame that Varnell brought his order is most unfortunate. Yes, it is. Praise the Maker. ...that you were his champion in that dark place. Look, we're both adults here. Can we drop the pretense? I think you'll find that I have said nothing threatening or untruthful. You and your careful language. I gave you what you wanted at considerable cost. Vonal is more manageable as a martyr, but his loss will be felt. You have avenged heretical Kunari with human blood. Surely that is good enough for you. It might be, if you were going to give this up. But you're not. Varnell was a fool, but the facts remain. An offense to the Maker goes unchallenged. I will give you no further cause to shame the Chantry today, but we will have this argument again. The Viscount's incompetence all but guarantees it. I don't like that woman. I wish I could have stayed here forever. I never wanted to rule Starkhaven. Is something troubling you? Goodbye. Walk in the Maker's Light. Well, at least Evelyn had something to say. button
As you can see, I'm putting things off. Check your purse. I think you lost something. Don't wave that around. I mean, thank you. I do not like that quest. Back to the Oreo Coke Zero, I guess. Hey, Nora. You and me in my room upstairs. Mm, what do you say? Not if you were the last man in the free marches. Another time, friend talk. Many of them, hopefully. Okay, I have done that. Okay. Time to go home, I guess. Okay, well, I am going to take a bit. Sell stuff. And then I'll go to Viscount's office. Okay, so that's not Isabella armor, that's mage armor. I think you're that. Come to me and I'll take you to places you've never been. Isabella, are you talking to Bianca? 
I think she deserves to feel a woman's touch on her trigger, don't you? Bianca responds to my touch. She'd never give it up for you. That's what they always say, and I always prove them wrong. Stop it. You're confusing her and me. Okay, I'm going to the Viscount's office. I've done that one. I really don't want to do the Underground Railroad. I don't feel like I need to do the Underground Railroad. Apparently not enough that the Kunari define my political life. My damn problem must there. also infect what I hold personal. It is my son, Seamus. The life you saved, he would now squander by converting to the Kun. He has left for the Kunari compound. Please, Sarah Hawk. Convince Seamus to come home. Mm. Did anyone else see him leaving for the compound? He made no secret of it. I'm sure he intended it as another of his statements about closer relations. Your example inspired him. I might agree, but now is not the time. These matters are... delicate. Politicians. He's politically dangerous, you mean? The office must remain strong, Sir Ahawk. He is of age. The decision seems rightly his. I want... To let him find his way but in my position he's taken a great deal of inspiration from you i want to allow his idealism but not blindly at best my opponents will claim that my office is now in canary hands at worst i lose my son you know this will only end in trouble fitting that's where it started my son is not foolish he will listen to reason, and you are in the best position to offer that opportunity. Please, do what you can. Good day, Sarah. Oh, this is going to get bloody. Watch your step. All set. Oh, 
I have not been having a good month. Well, his talk hasn't. Bets on who sent them? Anti Kunari group? Anti Viscount? Or Seamus himself? Seamus isn't the type. Let's go. Patrice. With all Patrice. I think we all know this. You go ahead. I have something I should do. No time for distractions, Isabella. I have business here. Well, you can go right ahead. Well, hope the Viscount's boy hasn't settled in. Sarah Hawk. I'm here about the Viscount's son. Are you? In four years, I have made no threat, and fanatics have lined up to hate us simply because we exist. But despite lies and fear, Ba still beg me to let them come to the Kuhn. They hunger for purpose. The son has made a choice. You will not deny him that. No doubt you see the advantage of having the Viscount's son at arm's reach. He is no longer the Viscount's son. Vidithari give up their lives for the certainty only Kunari know. You would not take advantage of his connections? The Kuhn may demand that advantage, but I do not. It was his choice to be educated. He is not my prisoner. He is not even here. He went to his father. Ask the Viscount why he would send you and the letter both. Yeah. That probably could have been mentioned earlier. They are meeting at the Chantry. A last pointless appeal, I assume. I doubt he'd involve the Chantry in such a personal matter. No, but we know who would. Mother Patrice. A suspect in many things. If she has threatened someone under my command again, there is only one response. I've had about enough of Patrice, several times over. A threat against Vidithari can have only one answer. I will suffer only one outcome. Yeah, I don't like Patrice. Oh, I will be watching, Hawk. The demand of the Kuhn is clear.
Okay. I'm going to take a break soon. I really hope Isabella's back. Sarah Hawk, look at what you have done. To pounce upon the Viscount's son, a repentant convert in the Chantry itself. A crime with no excuse. Your Kunari masters will finally answer. All this will do is make people hate you. I have kept the fear of the Kunari fresh in every sermon, every prayer. They will know whose word to believe. When people learn of this attack, they will rise. Not zealots or the unknowing, but the true majority. Great plan. Until people start dying in a war with the Kunari. To die untested would be the real crime. People need the opportunity to defend faith, starting with you. Earn your reward in this life and next. These heretics must die. Oh, great. I don't have Isabella with me. I'm going to see if I can get somebody. I want a full party for this. I want a full party for this. A full party, not a wonderful party. The party is kind of wonderful. Sorry, I'm watching my captions. Your Kunari masters will finally... See your grace? Traitors attacking the very core of the Chantry. They defile with every step. I should have brought there Sebastian. is death in every corner, young mother. It is as you predicted. All too well. I'm not in a mood right now. She's onto you, Patrice. Quick, lie harder. Don't you spout your Kunari filth. This is a hand of the divine. I have ears, Mother Patrice. The Maker would have me use them. Viscount Dumas's son is dead. Killed here in your name. I'm sure my name won't like that. Patrice? Seamus Dumas was a Canari convert. He came here to repent and was murdered. Love or hate the Canari, a blind nug could see she took this too far. No price is too much when we speak of eternity. Eternity is long enough that we need not rush to meet it. They deny the Maker. 
and you diminish him, even as you claim his side. Andraste did not volunteer for the flame. Sirrah Hawk, you act on behalf of the Viscount? The young mother has erred in her judgment. A court will decide her fate. The Chantry respects the law, and so must she. Grand Cleric? They turned Grand your cleric? back on you. Yes, this makes me happy. We protect those of the Kune. We do not abandon our own. She makes me, this makes me very happy. Please, send for Viscount Dumas. Because at least she's dead. My son. Murdered in the heart of the Chantry by those who held a sacred trust. What hope for this city when we fail our own so completely? The Arishok is still here, Excellency. You must be ready to stand up to him. I cannot. I have already failed where it mattered most. Please. Hawk. Leave me. Great now. Kunari and the Chantry and a dead son will just fade from memory. About that. Uh, Hawk, there's something I need to tell you at your house very, very soon. Do I even want to know, Isabella? No, don't answer. Okay. I'm. I'm going to continue. Puppies are resting in the kennel. I'm going to risk it. This is important. Don't interrupt with your selfish prattle. Get off your high horse. I have problems, too. <laughs> what drink should I order, and who's the father? Oh, you little... Are there any good seats left? Hawk, the Arashok is sheltering two fugitives who have converted to the Cune. He must be convinced to release them. He's already feared because of Patrice. If people start to think he can ignore the law, I need your help so this doesn't get out of hand. I'm going to die. There. Got your attention. Real problem. Yeah. I heard Arashok and die. What's this about? Remember the relic? The one Castillon is going to kill me over? A man called Wall-Eyed Sam has it. If you help me get it, Castillon won't kill me. Please. I'm trying to keep the entire city from rioting against the Canari. Well, maybe it's connected. What? I'm just saying maybe it will help. It's important to someone, right? Now you start being responsible? Shit. 
Okay. Fugitives. Isn't it odd that someone would run to the Canari? They're elves accused of murder. Maybe they feel they've nothing to lose by fleeing the alienage. And if their conversion is genuine? I don't know. But how many more will try if I allow this? Justice must be respected. You're expecting trouble? After what happened to the Viscount's son? Yes. I'm hoping the Canari aren't looking for a fight. I'm hoping they'll be reasonable. But we'll see. Now, why me? This seems like an issue for you and your guards. Quite a few of them. Sending a full patrol would just increase tension. But you're right. I am the captain. It's my responsibility. But I suspect the Viscount was hoping I would bring this to you. Then he should have come himself. Perhaps. But it's understandable that he's not at his best. I'd like to help him if I can. Uh. You're sure this is the relic you're after? I've had my ear to the ground for a while. There was a description of the book. It's the right one. Book? I thought you didn't know what the relic was. Well, I... I, I know it's a book. But that's all I know. It's written in a foreign tongue. Honestly, what does it matter? It'll save me from Castillon, so I need it. Why has this come up so suddenly, Isabella? Sam's been talking to black market dealers all over Lowtown. It didn't take me long to get wind of it. What frustrates me is that he's held onto the relic so long. Tell me about Sam. Sam used to run with Martin. Remember him? Martin says Sam's a bit of a magpie, picking up things that don't belong to him. Not a trustworthy sort. When Martin gave up raiding, Sam became a drifter. Who was involved in this exchange? Tivinta mages. I doubt they'll look kindly on us interrupting. Bring a sword, or twelve. Okay, I need this, so I'm gonna do this. The relic issue has to be resolved before we take on the Kunari. You trust her this much? Probably not. I wouldn't. They won't wait at the compound forever, Hawk. I really do hope this helps, because if it doesn't... You think I like having this thing on my mind? Come on. The exchange is happening tonight in a low-town foundry. Oh yes, just where I want to go. A low-town foundry. Are you sure about this? The champion was asked to go to the Canari. I suppose you think he planned the entire thing. Considering what it led to. Come on, Seeker. I'm not going to sell Hawk short. But nobody could have foreseen the way that that would go down. Or do you still think I'm lying to protect my friend? There are elements of your story that make sense. And you couldn't have known about them otherwise. Well, that's a relief. But that doesn't mean you're telling me everything. I want this story to be told. You're not the first to get it all wrong. I think I owe Hawk that much. <sighs> that dog. Well, maybe two marks add character to the piece. Good to see you again, sir. If you need me for anything, by all means, let me know. That big tower in the lake is scary. The Andra is gallows. Dead. Believe it. Okay. <clears throat> I'm just not going to bring Varric with me everywhere. I'm almost done with the act, so I might as well finish it. Oh, great. I'm best friends with Anders.
the hanged man. Sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name. No, not right now. I don't have your stupid relic. Shark asks why we killed his men. We'll say it was an accident. Uh, yes. About that. The relic belongs to the Canari, and there's a small chance they want it back. Do the Canari look like the sharing type to you? Of course they want it back. I've always known what the relic is. I just didn't want to worry you. The relic is a Canari text handwritten by that philosopher of theirs. Uh, Keslin, Kuzlin, whatever his name is. Koslin? That's the one. The founder of their religion, the most revered being in their history. That text would be sacred beyond measure. I stole it from them. They followed me here to reclaim it, and it's why they're still in Kirkwall. They can't leave the free marches without it. How did you steal the relic from the Kunari? The Arashok never had it. The Orlesians did. They had of plans course. to return it to the Canari. I simply had to waylay the Orlesian convoy before it met up with the Arashok and his men. Getting the relic was easy. Getting away from the Canari was the hard part. And... I thought you and the Canari were caught in a storm. The storm was only half of it. I also had the Canari Dreadnought stuck to my behind like a bad rash, spitting fire and thunder at me. Why would anyone besides the Canari want this relic? The Tavinta Imperium have been at war with the Canari for centuries. If the Tavintas get the relic, it will strike a blow to Canari morale. That's probably what the mages want. Maybe giving it back would solve Aveline's problem. That mess is over a couple of elves. I need it to save my own skin. Sounds like the Canari take their reading very seriously. Is there anything in the Canari don't take seriously? Look, the book's right in this building, and I'm not letting it slip away again. It's the only thing that'll get Castillon off my back. Please, tell me you'll give the relic to me. It's yours. Your life depends on it. Really? I... I wasn't expecting that. It's nice to have someone on my side for once. Come on, we've no time to waste. Still don't like this quest. Well, I, I don't hate this quest. It, it was the other quest. Sorry, the relic? my brain's still stuck I, on it. Uh, I have it. The tome of Koslan will not fall into Defender hands. Blood and spite. A toss, Kanari! He's getting away. Isabella!
like the looks of this. Now Isabella's got some splaining to do. I gotta be in this hundred again. Trap. Watch your step. I don't like the looks of this. I do not like being here. Okay. Well, Isabella can have it if she comes back. But I'm going to loot everything. Okay. Dear Hawk, I have the relic and I am gone. I'm sorry it has to be this way. You've been a loyal ally. This is the best for both of us. You promised me the relic, and I know you'll fight Castian for me, but I don't want this. I've dragged you too far into this mess already. You don't have to forgive me, but I hope you understand. Isabella. Once a thief, always a thief. Come on. Aveline will be waiting at the Canari compound. We still have to deal with that mess. Yeah, I just don't want to. Wrong way. This is it. This is it. OK. 
Okay, I'm going to get a full party. We get a full party first. Then I'm going to take a quick break and set things up. I'll do a quick save here. Then I'm going to take a quick break, get something set up, and... Uh, yeah. Okay, see you on the flip side. Okay. I'm back. Wrap up any other business before we go. It's already a mess, and could get worse. Let's go. I request an audience with the Arashok. He will allow it, but not in this number. I will only bring my friend here and a small compliment of my guard. Is that few enough? It is. Enter. Greetings, Arashok. We come regarding the elven fugitives that took refuge here. Irrelevant. I would speak to Hark about the relics stolen from my grasp. Oh, I'm sure I'll find. If you give me time, I'll get it back for you. It is much too late for that. An issue for another time. We're here for the fugitives. The elves are now Vidithari. They have chosen to submit to the Kuhn. They will be protected. Have they truly converted? Or are they simply using you as a shield? They have chosen, and so have I. You have not hidden the abuses of your zealots or the corruption of this city. You will understand why I must do this. Let us look at your dangerous criminals. Speak, Vidathari. Who did you murder, and why? A city guard forced himself on our sister. We reported him, or tried to, but they did nothing about it, no matter what we said. So my brothers and I paid him a visit. That doesn't excuse murder. Are these elves telling the truth? There have been rumors. I will investigate, but they still took the law into their own hands. Sometimes that is necessary. Like you avenged the Viscount's son. It was not right then, and it's not right now. I would have done the same thing in their shoes. Hawk, that's not helping. Their actions are mere symptoms. Your society is the disease. They have chosen. The Vidithari will submit to the Kune and find a path your way has denied them. You can't just decide that. You must hand them over. Yeah, I don't think he's going to do that, Aveline. Really don't. I really do Tell not. Tell me, Hawk. What would you do in my place? In your place? Why pass up perfectly good converts? Exactly so. I cannot leave without the relic, and I cannot stay and remain blind to this dysfunction. There is only one solution. Arashok, there is no need for. 
hoping that cut us. And here we go. I still gotta make some dinner too. Can you hear it? The canary must be spreading out. They're attacking the city. Why? What could they possibly hope to accomplish? Somehow, I don't think the Arashal cares what happens after this. You may be right. Whatever it is, we need to do something quickly, but we'll need some help. Okay. Did you go back with the guard? Yes. Our friends from Parvalan decided to take over after all. Oh, yes. The Canari are assaulting the city and fast. The Arashok planned this for who knows how long. I'll rally the guardsmen. I suggest heading to your estate in Hightown. Be careful. Oh, we're not heading there. Is he taking all my bet? All, all mine? Good work, Crypto. Do all the looting. The alien is protected at least.
I got the mage. How many of you gotten Varric? Sincere thanks. This attack was most unexpected. We have not met. No, we haven't. Of the Good for you. I cannot believe the Kunari would dare such an attack. This will lead to war with the free marches for certain. Probably. I fear pressing matters take us elsewhere, but we can spread word to the other free cities. Perhaps they will bring aid. There's something more important than an invasion. There is, but I cannot say more. The Kunari are of far greater concern to you, I'm certain. But we must return to our mission. Then get out of here. Reinforcements would come in handy if we fail. Even if we wish to, Grey Wardens cannot involve themselves in political. Uh huh. Totally couldn't. Ne no, they never. No, they would never this, would do that. No. They never would do that. Never. Never, 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 Maybe never do that. Over you, my friend. Okay. Okay, I'm hearing puppies. So, I am going to take a break here just to deal with puppies. I will be back in a second. See you on the flip side. Okay, I'm back again. Sorry about that. Puppies needed to go out. There's the hanged man. Oh, great looters. Thing is, they're probably in uh, both are entering the blight, too. Are you sure you want to do this? are there? Oh, now the coder is getting involved. Oh, great. Yeah, at least this will be some XP. They really did need to kill things. Sorry the AC is staying on tonight. Well, for the rest of the stream, it is really warm. And my keyboard was getting really hot. 
That was a few looters. Going everywhere, just to be on the safe side. Okay. Don't need looting getting worse, do we? Only I can loot. Right now, I want to loot the hangman for some booze. Look, man, I don't want to do this, but you leave me to a choice. I hope I didn't kill Leaning Canary. Really hope I'm not killing the Leaning Canary. Can't believe the Canary letting them have money. I would suggest, um, they would want them to own personal effects. That would suggest, you know, they're letting them be, you know, their own person. Which is not exactly Canary, because you are your role. But at the same time, you know, it could be to buy supplies for that particular role. Hey, Gamba.
out your struggling woman. Tepa! Boss! Then the Aeroshock failed to take you captive. Unfortunate. Oh, yes. Fortunate for you. I think so. Nope, uh, I don't think so. I am Knight Commander Meredith. Good for you. Good for you. I know you. Yeah, you have my sister. Can I have her back, please? The Hawk has turned up in my reports many times. Too many. Probably because my, my, my sister's a troublemaker. The Kunari are taking people to the keep and may already be in control. We will need to deal with them. No, of course. Always happy to help in a life-threatening crisis. Good. Your skills will be sorely needed. Head to the keep and I will see if I can find more of my men. These creatures will pay for this outrage. I think Fenris is in love. I am not. Because she still hasn't given me back my sister. I want my sister. I want to trade out Anders for my sister. Please. I'm going to continue looking for anything to loot. Yeah, why not? All of them. They all count as my kills. You're part of my party. They're all my kills. I'm the player character. They're all my kills. We should have just let them fight. Don't take out any survivors. 
Just saying. Oh, okay, good. The brothel's protected. Gotta protect the brothel, man. Looks like you fared better than the other mages. The others? Surely they cannot all be. Thinking, child. I told you to let them take me. We had to do something. We couldn't just. I'm glad you're safe. The city's under attack. None of us are safe. No, you're safe. First enchanter or Sino. You survive. And I can have my sister back for the fight. I want my sister back. Overwhelms me like I want my sister back. There is no time for talk. We must strike back before it's too late. And who will lead us into this battle? You? I will fight to defend this city as I have always done. To control it, you mean? I won't have our lives tossed to the flames to feed your vanity. Will you two just shut up? I won't have you two at each other's throats. I'm in charge. You? You're not even of this city. Neither am I. Yet I don't hear you complaining about us both fighting to defend our home. Very well, then. But whatever you plan, be quick about it. Why am I not surprised? Tell us, then. What is our course of action? I take it running for the hills isn't an option? Or we could find out what they're up to. That works, too. An excellent choice. Let's move quickly. Somebody had to shut her up. They would stand here fighting all day.
three on the left, four on the right. Then they've already taken it over. Clearly, they've been planning this for some time. Perhaps we should have been planning ourselves. Good point. This is the only way in. We must assault them now before their numbers grow. Can I my sister? Are you mad? They have hostages. We need a distraction. Decide quickly. We have no time. Let's hear what you have in mind, Orsino. We'll need to get you inside and catch up as soon as we can. And just how will we do this? Have confidence, Knight Commander. A few fireballs might, you know, would help. Fireworks, maybe? You will not conquer this city without a fight! Cerebos! Finish Caucus! That provides a distraction. Can I have my sister back? Can I replace Anders with my sister? I really want to replace Anders with my sister. Can I have An my sister? Do I have to have Anders? I don't want Anders. I want my sister. She's lovely. She's a sweetie. Darn, I wanted my sister. Watch your step. Where's the service? Okay, there's the service. No, I should bring my dog into this one. Why you don't mess with elves? That's why you don't mess with elves. Okay, as far as I know. Take a break.
Okay. Your Vicar. You dare? You are starting a war. Look at you. Like Bat doth Rossi, you feed and feed and complain only when your meal is interrupted. You do not look up. You do not see that the grass is bare. All you leave in your wake is misery. You are blind. I will make you see. You and what army? But oh, we have wait. Guests. Sinead on, Hawk. I expected you. No, oh, that's nice. Moras to Ebrishok. You alone are Basilidan. This is what respect looks like, boss. Some of you will never earn it. So tell me, Hawk. You know I am denied Parvalin until the Tome of Kozloon is found. How would you see this conflict resolved without it? That's how. I believe I can answer that. I'm sure you'll find it mostly undamaged. The Tome. It took me a while to get back, what with all the fighting everywhere. You know how it is. Heroic acts of sacrifice? What will people say? This is your damned influence, Hawk. I was halfway to Ostwick before I knew I had to turn round. It's pathetic. The relic is reclaimed. I am now free to return to Parvalin with the thief. No. What? You thought you could strand them here for four years without consequence? She stole the Tome of Kazloon. She must return with us. No. Isabella will answer according to our lords, not yours. Then you leave me no choice. I challenge you, Hawk. You and I will battle to the death with her as the prize. No. If you're going to duel anyone, duel me. You are not Basilidan. You are unworthy. Then. All right. Let's dance. Marathas! So shall it be! Okay, I'll have to survive. Barely in broke a sweat. One day we shall return. Yeah, but not today. A 
Take your book and go. Return it to the library. Overdraft fees are a killer. Is it over? It's over. The city has been saved! Oh, great. Couldn't you just killed all of them? It appears Kirkwall has a new champion. You seem confused, Seeker. The champion killed the Arashok in single combat? It just sounds... So it wasn't single romantic. combat. I had a Mabari with if me. I know better, I'd say you're developing a little crush. Don't be ridiculous. The champion just seems very heroic in your tale. Mm-hmm. If you're telling the truth. If you are, then... What happened at the gallows may be far different than we assumed. I need to hear it. Let's say I tell you. Then what? Is the Chantry out for revenge? Is that what this is all about? No, it's not that. Then what about me? If what I tell you isn't what you want to hear, will you still let me go? I will let you go. Well, now we're talking. None of this is what I thought it would be. Tell me what really happened. Oh, okay. I have a report you might find interesting. It tells of a chasm in the Vinmark Mountains. ...and the secret that was said to be buried within. Yet when the Chantry went to investigate... ...they were turned away by the Grey Wardens. And... ...why would I find that interesting? Because the Champion was there! I can't help but notice you failed to mention this... ...adventure. Oh, that? I didn't think you'd be interested. Just some business with Hawk's family... A few carded dwarves who went too far. <sighs> You're not going to believe me. I'll take my chances. All right. Don't say I didn't warn you. There it is. That's where these dwarves are? These are carded dwarves. So they're more criminals and smugglers than anything else. They're not usually stupid, though. I don't know why they'd attack you. They snuck into the gallows. If there hadn't been Templars to stop them. Don't feel left out. They've been trying to kill me for several days now. You have a plan, then? I found their hideout, but my sources couldn't tell me anything else. It's all very strange. Why do you say that? It's just the Carter, isn't it? As far as my contacts and the Carter know, they shouldn't be here. There shouldn't even be a here. Now, this place is invisible. A big blind spot on the map. Bianca's never been this suspicious. And she's twitchy to start with. Bianca's in the Carta? We just need them to stop trying to kill us. A fine point. So, what's the plan? Oh, I'm sure this is all a misunderstanding. Later we'll all have tea and we'll laugh. Oh, your name is Hawk. I thought it was Locke. <laughs> I can't believe you two are joking about it's this. It's my coping mechanism. <laughs> Don't worry, Sunshine. <laughs> the laughter just hides the pain. At least the Circle let me come. I didn't want you to do this alone. Let's go. I got my sister back. Okay, and after I do one thing,
I'm going to call it here. Next week, we'll do Legacy and maybe start Act 3. Um, I will be back on Thursday with Pokemon Arceus. Until then, I have to go make dinner, so I guess I will see you on the flip side. Bye. <laughs>